This next video in our Gmail series is going to show you how to take messages in your inbox and organize them with labels. I'm going to do an existing label with Loom and I'm going to make a new label with the Walgreens message. For the Loom message, I'm going to select. You're going to go up to, it looks like a price tag in my opinion. You're going to click on that. Labels. And as you can see, I've already made a label for Loom. So I'm simply going to click there. Then I'm going to go down and click apply. And you'll notice that there is the Loom label actually on the email after doing that. So that is all set. So I'm going to uncheck the box. And now I'm going to make a label for my Walgreens emails. Because I do get a lot of emails from Walgreens. So I'm going to check the box next to the email. Go back up to the labels icon. Click on it. And then I'm going to make a Walgreens tab. So I've typed it in. Click on Walgreens, create new. Don't worry about the nesting the label under, under anything. We're going to keep it simple. Just keep Walgreens and click create. So now you have created a Walgreens label and it already added your conversation to the Walgreens setting there. And if you look over to the left, you have your email in the Walgreens label. I have my Loom email over here in my Loom label. This, your drafts are also over here. Your sent mails are here. Your snoozed emails are here, which I'm going to do a video on those. It's a wonderful feature. And of course, you have your inbox. And if you click on more, you'll see your trash and your spam and your scheduled emails, which I showed you that earlier. All mail just has a little bit of everything. But if you want to keep a nice, clean, easy view, just go ahead and click on the inbox label. So that is how to make labels for your inbox emails. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments. I'm happy to help. Thank you for listening, and I hope you have a great day.